This is your question. Up, if you remember the questions that used to be asked from us was first, find dy by dx. Is that the question? Yeah. Find dy by dx. So, how do we get it? 4x minus 6. Excellent. Second question is our other thing. Find gradient of tangent at x. Find gradient of the tangent at x is equal to 1, suppose. I'll just keep writing the answers also. For this one, you said it is 4x minus 6, right? Yeah. Hmm. For this one, ye kaise nikalenge? So we'll put on the x value and hmm. then it will be minus. A and ye x value, where will we put? 1 will put for x. Um, in, the we'll, in the equation we'll put or in dy by dx we'll put? Um, dy by dx. So dy by dx at x equals to 1 is 4 into 1 minus 6, which is minus 2. So this is the gradient at x equals to 1, correct? Yeah. Now, third part of the question. We are just revising through us. We have to ask questions. So this pattern would remain the same. Next was find equation of the tangent at x equals to 1. Equation of tangent at x equals to 1. But that's already the Equation. The tangent is a line, correct? Hmm. So, how do we get this equation? Um, we'll use y minus y1 is equal to y. y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1, correct? Yeah. Okay. So, first we'll have to find y by putting minus 2 hmm. in norm. Is humko is missy ye to pata we know that m at x equals to 1 is equal to minus 2. Itna pata hai hai, right? This we know already. Yeah. Correct? So, what is the value of when x is equal to 1? What is the value of y? When x is equal to 1, y is equal to what? That is what we have to find. Yeah. So that humko y1 or x1 ki values malum chal jai. X1 तो पता ही है, Y1 निकालना था. अब ये Y हमको निकालने के लिए कहां से निकालेंगे आपको value? How will we find? Main equation. Main equation. So, what was the main equation? It was 2X square minus 6X plus 5. So, we are going to put it here. 2X square minus 6X plus 5. Correct? Yeah x square minus 6x plus 5. So we are putting 1 here, correct? Yeah. So what is the answer? What did you say? 1. It's 1. Y is equal to 1. So when x is equal to 1, y is equal to 1. Correct? These are the two things. Yeah. Okay, perfect. We will put, we now know everything. So y minus 1 is equal to minus 2 x minus one. Yeah. Final answer kya hoga? Y is equal to? Um, minus 2x plus 3. So this is the final answer. How many can we get? Equation of the tangent. tangent at x is equals to 1. Correct? Yeah. Right? Okay. Now, fourth type of question which was being asked from this. Then it is equation of the tangent nikaliya. Ab wo pooch hai, find the normal. Find the 
normal sorry find the equation of the normal find the equation of the normal at x is equals to 1 ab kya karna hai um first we'll find gradient of the normal gradient of the normal so m at x equals to 1 was minus 2 therefore m of the and this is this is for the tangent right this was for the tangent so for north therefore m of the at x equals to 1 for normal would be um what? 1 upon minus 1 upon 2 1 upon 2 excellent 1 upon 2 okay and the points are the same this is when at 1 comma 1 xp1 or yb1 we are talking about the same two points yeah so we have everything so batao equation kya banegi y minus y minus 1 is equal to 1 upon 2 x minus 1 superb ab iska equation bana do y is equal to 1 upon 2x plus half. x plus 1 upon 2. Can we take this 2 as an LCM? That's the final answer. Right? Yeah. Next. Next was find X coordinate. of the stationary point. Find x coordinate of the stationary point. That's dy by dx is equal to zero. So four x minus six is equal to zero. 4x minus 6 is equal to, equal to 6 upon 4. Hmm. 3 upon 2. So dy by dx is equal to 0. So x ka value kitni hai? 3 upon 2. 3 upon 2. Which is 1.5. Correct? Next. Find nature of the stationary point. Hmm. So, um, double differentiation. Okay. That will be 4 only. It will be 4. So, d square y by dx square is equal to 4. So, what does that mean? Oh, it's a minimum. It's a minimum because it's positive. It's greater than zero. Correct? Yeah. D square y by dx square is greater than zero. Okay. So, so what if we had double differentiation and we got an x value in it? Then we would have to put the x value and find, right? Correct. Huh. Then you put 
वन वैल्यू विच इज क्रिटिकल पॉइंट्स निकाल करके थोड़ा सा छोटा और थोड़ा सा बड़ा वैल्यू निकाल करके करना होगा क्रिटिकल पॉइंट वन पॉइंट फाइव दिस इज डी वाई बाई डी एक्स जो आपने यहाँ निकाला ना दिस फ्रॉम द प्रीवियस वन करेक्ट जो डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इक्वल्स टू जीरो पुट करते हैं हम सो दिस इज वन मेथड दिस इज आर वन मेथड जहां पर आप इधर दिस मेथड और यू कैन पुट दैट एक्स इज इक्वल टू वन पॉइंट फाइव अब इससे एक छोटा वैल्यू ले लो और इससे एक बड़ा वैल्यू ले लो लेस एंड मोर ठीक है वट एवर यू फाइंड इजी राइट एंड यू चेक बाई पुटिंग दैट वैल्यू तो लेस हम ले लेते हैं वन मोर हम ले लेते हैं टू एंड देन यू पुट इन डी वाई बाई डी एक्स ठीक है और यहाँ पर करो डी वाई बाई डी एक्स एट एक्स इक्वल टू टू वेन यू डू दैट वॉट इज द फाइनल आंसर बेस्ड ऑन दैट यू विल गेट द आंसर ठीक है क्लियर नेक्स्ट सो वाई आर वी टॉकिंग अबाउट दीज थिंग्स यूर बिकॉज ना आई एम गिव यू अ क्वेश्चन सब कुछ सेम है दीदी बट द क्वेश्चन इज just have a look the framing of the question will be same just the equation will be a little based on what you have learned just now like in a bit latest you are getting my point yeah so just e raised to power 2x minus 9 ex equation ya theek se nahi aaya so e raised to power 2x minus 9 e raised to power x then it's a plus 7x find the exact value of the coordinates uh at each of the stationary points and determine the nature of each stationary point theek hai so uh sabse pehle you what what are we supposed to do hame kya kya karna padega idhar distance was differentiate hmm dy by dx kar liya क्या आया डीवाई बाई डी एक्स इफ देर इज अंस्टेंट नेक्स्ट टू ई रेज टू एक्स डू वी हैव टू लाइक डिफ्रेंशिएट दैट नहीं नहीं वो तो फिर साइड मतलब डोंट हैव टू डिफ्रेंशिएट इफ इट्स नॉट अ वेरिएबल देन यू डोंट डिफ्रेंशिएट दैट वो तो आप साइड कर लेते हैं एज अ कॉन्स्टेंट वो साइड हो जाता है अनलेस इट इज अ वेरिएबल डोंट हैव टू डिफ्रेंशिएट So this will remain the same only, right? This step is done. हाँ, so क्या आ रहा है आपका आंसर? Differentiate करके बताओ क्या आ रहा है? एक बार differentiate करने से. Two e raised to two x minus nine e raised to two x plus seven. Minus nine e raised to power x plus seven, ना? Yeah. Plus seven, correct? Okay. So 
सो दैट्स योर डी वाई बाई डी एक्स हमको क्या करना है वी हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स कोऑर्डिनेट एट ईच ऑफ द स्टेशनरी पॉइंट्स स्टेशनरी पॉइंट्स कैसे निकालो अब मैं सो यू विल हैव टू डू पहला पॉइंट ये हो गया अब नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डू डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इज इक्वल्स टू जीरो राइट सो विच मीन्स टू रेस्ट टू पार ई टू एक्स माइनस नाइन ई रेस्ट टू पार एक्स प्लस सेवन इज इक्वल टू जीरो दिस इज समथिंग वी लर्न इन लॉग्स राइट लेट एस टेक ई रेस्ट टू पार एक्स एज वाई और सम अदर वेरिएबल ए ले लेते बी ले लेते कुछ भी एनीथिंग लाइक दैट लेट्स टेक इट एज ए नॉट टेकिंग एज वाई बिकॉज वाई ऑलरेडी वी आर टेकिंग फॉर डी वाई बाई डी एक्स सो टू ए स्क्वायर माइनस नाइन ए प्लस सेवन इज इक्वल टू जीरो ओके सो यू विल हैव टू आंसर्स फॉर दिस क्या क्या आंसर आ रहा है Oh, a is equal to one, and a is equal to seven upon two. So a is equal to one, and dusra a is equal to seven upon two. These are the two answers. Yeah. Okay. Which means this a is nothing but e raised to power x. Yeah. Is equal to one, and e raised to power x is equal to seven upon two. राइट अब हमको इधर हम कैसे निकालते थे एक्स की वैल्यू लॉग लॉग सो ये कौन सा लॉग होगा एल होगा कि लॉग होगा एल एन इट बी आई डोंट नो आई थिंक आई फॉर गोट एन एल एन एल एन एनी थिंग विच हैज सी इट इट बिकम्स लॉग टू द बेस ई ऑफ वन is equal to x and log to the base e of 7 upon 2 is equal to x correct or log to the base e jab bhi hoga usko hum ln likhte hain so ln 1 is equal to x and ln 7 upon 2 is equal to x so we will have two answers yeah that is why we have two answers here right ab ln 1 uh, uh it's ye kab ho sakta ये तो जीरो हो गया सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक आंसर क्या आ रहा है हमारा जीरो इक्वल टू जीरो एक ये आंसर आ रहा है और दूसरा आंसर क्या आ रहा है ठीक है ओके नेक्स्ट ये भी निकल गया सो नाउ इट इज आस्किंग फाइंड द एग्जैक्ट वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स कोऑर्डिनेट्स At each of the stationary points, यहाँ तक हो गया हमारा. So the x coordinates are these two. At each of the station stationary points, right? Then, then determine the nature of each stationary point. उसके लिए क्या करना होगा? Um, double differentiation. Double differentiation. So do it. So I found it as four e raised to two x minus nine e raised to x. So do I do I now have to put in the x values? Ah, yes. E square y upon four e raised to part two x. If I write this right down, 
d square y by d x square is equal to four e then raised to power two x then minus nine e raised to x e raised to power x right okay for so by putting zero I got the answer as minus five which is maximum. Okay, so when you put x is equals to zero, what do you get? Minus five. When x is equals to zero, then you get answer is d square y by d x square is minus five. Yani ki negative. Which is which means it is what? Maxima. Maxima. Very good. Um, and the other one, I don't know how to put this. Do we have to do it like the normal way? Normal, huh? Bas 1.25 down though. Put 1.25 and check. What do you get? But then how do we put it in the calculator? So you will have to put it in the calculator. You have to put just up e raised to bar zero dollar. X yamper yamper into 1.25 2 into 1.25 yamper e raised to bar just 1.25. Not getting it. Uh, but then that one I just made at one because it was raised to zero. Yeah, for e raised to zero, it was not going to be done. But it was going to be done. Right? Here it is 4e. Yeah, okay. I got it. e raised to power 1.25 into 2. Right? Minus. 9 e raised to power 1.25. Answer which are 17. Yeah, one second. Yeah, same. 17.3. 17. You know, 0.3. So, which means it is positive. So, it is a Minimum. So nature will be gaya. So you understood the concept is still the same. How what, what we used to do earlier? Finding dy by dx, finding yeah. the gradient, right? Finding the equation of the tangent, finding the equation of the normal, you know, finding the x coordinate, finding the nature of the stationary points. Yes, sub could same rega. Just that the equation that you will get now. Will not be a line anymore. So much we have it. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. But this part you've understood, right? So observe how we do our questions. Now the question is How much more is that? For this differentiation? Yeah. For this for this topic? Yeah, yeah. One second. So only one more topic is left. Um parametric form We are we are still in this. Mm. So is it possible to just finish the third one today only? Uh, third one today only? I don't think so. That's a completely new topic. So we are doing some portion involving the tangents and normals. We are doing this part only for the, for the four, third part only. Hmm. For such equations. Kind of in a way we are doing that only. But just uh, um, first derivative of function which is defined is this part. Can you see that? Yeah. You see this? We have started already. So okay, is it possible to do a class tomorrow? Tomorrow, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Okay. If it's possible, I'll definitely. But, but the only thing is that uh, it might be a little up. What time is it like for you? Like, uh, what time do you get up? What time are you going to be? Abhi it's 11 o'clock. What time will you be Abhi? Um, I can do it at 12 Indian time. 
tomorrow. Hmm. So Possibly? that's seven thirty for me. Seven thirty. What about twelve thirty one? Twelve thirty, I can do. Hmm. Oh, let me see. Let me see because twelve thirty का मतलब हुआ twelve thirty to one thirty, right? Let me tell you. ठीक है? Yeah. Okay. अगर मैं थोड़ा late होकर के बताऊँ तो चलेगा ना? Yeah. yeah. Even one, if it's okay, that would be better. Actually, uh, I had an appointment, so I will see that I will take it according to it. Because I had an appointment for the morning first half, so I will see that I will tell you according to it. So I will just check the timings. Okay. Now, let's do another question. Y is equal to X plus cos 2x that's your equation now this is a curve obviously cos 2x hai to curve hoga ye yeah again the question says you have to find the x coordinates of the stationary points For which, okay. Now, यहाँ पर एक because it is it is going to be uh, it's cos theta, right? So यहाँ पर आपको एक limit भी दी जा रही है. And you have to same determine the nature. ठीक है? Yeah. So when we are differentiating cos two x, will it become like minus sine two x or minus sine x? So if you remember the formula for this was what? Sine. The formula kya tha? Differentiation of cos ka it was minus sine x. Cos it was minus sine x, so minus sine x as it is. Just a hair. Right? But then we have to take minus sine two x, right? Ah, so it it doesn't matter. So it will become minus sine two x multiplied by two. Yeah. And this would become one. Yeah. So sine two x is equal to one upon two. Sine two x is equal to one upon two. Okay, dy by dx is equal to zero. Therefore, sine two x is equal to one upon two. So, so then what is the steps that we have to follow? So two x is equal to sine inverse of one upon two. So two x को पहले हम a मानेंगे, ठीक है? और हमारे यहाँ पे हमने कुछ rules follow करने हैं, right? जो कुछ steps को follow करना है. हमारे यहाँ पे क्या दिया हुआ है जीरो एक्स एंड फाइव राइट तो वॉट डू वी हैव टू चेंज इट इन टू दिस वी हैव टू मेक टू एक्स दिस विल बिकम जीरो एंड दिस विल बिकम टू पाए करेक्ट ओके पहला तो ये चेंज हमको करना है टू एक्स को हमने यहाँ पर सो दिस बिकॉज दिस टू एक्स इज नथिंग बट ए नाउ सो दिस इज हाउ इट विल है सो देर फोर Sine a is equal to one upon two. Now you will find the values for a. So zero point five two four is one. Please say hello. Zero point five two four. Zero point five to four मतलब that is one value of x of a. Zero point four मतलब uh, are you zero point five to four?
क्योंकि आप जैसे ही पाई की वैल्यू डालोगे ना देन यूर राउंडिंग इट ऑफ टू अट एक्सटेंट तो आंसर चेंज हो जाते हैं हमारे इसलिए ठीक है सो एल्फा आ गया पाई बाय सिक्स सो विच मीन्स इन माई ग्राफ How do I show it? In my graph, this is thirty degrees five by six. Yeah. So, फिर यहाँ भी thirty degrees. But हमें क्या चाहिए? Positive answer चाहिए. So A S, right? So I'm talking about this angle and this angle. I will have yeah. a thirty degree angle here also, but can I go here and here? No. ये दो angles भी हैं हमारे पास, but यहाँ पे positive ये हम नहीं ले सकते और ये भी हम नहीं ले सकते because यहाँ negative answers आते हैं and मुझे positive answer चाहिए one upon two. Yeah. Right. Okay. Which means I am talking about which angle? What all angles? Thirty degrees. And one fifty. Thirty and one fifty. Thirty का मतलब हुआ five by six. So A का आंसर हुआ five by six and five five by six. Yeah. Right. अंडरस्टूड ठीक है नाउ ये तो हुआ ए का आंसर राइट सो विच मीन्स टू एक्स इज इक्वल टू फाइव बाय सिक्स एंड टू एक्स इज इक्वल टू फाइव फाइव बाय सिक्स सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू करेक्ट अब ये क्या क्या आ गए हमारे ये वॉट इज दिस आंसर फॉर क्या आंसर आया है हमें वैल्यू ऑफ द स्टेशनरी पॉइंट दिस दीज आर द वैल्यू ऑफ द स्टेशनरी पॉइंट राइट अब हमको क्या निकालना है सो दीज आर द टू क्रिटिकल पॉइंट एक्स वैल्यूज हमारे पास आ गए Now the question was asking us to find the nature. So x coordinates are done. X coordinates are done. अब हमको nature निकालना. Nature निकालने के लिए क्या करना होगा? Double differentiation. Double double differentiation. जब डिफ्रेंशिएट किया था तो इट इट वाज अब हमको डी वाई डी डी बाई डी एक्स ऑफ वन माइनस टू माइनस फोर कॉस टू एक्स विच इज माइनस फोर कॉस टू एक्स एक्सलोटली अब नाउ नेचर निकालने के लिए हमको क्या करना है एक्स वैल्यू 
at x is equal to 5 by 12 d square y by dx square is equal to minus 4 cos 2 pi by 12 yeah. and you see value x is equal to 5 pi by 12 is equal to d square y by dx square minus 4 cos 2 5 pi by 12 we can cancel the 2 and 12. Yes, we can. Um, 1 is minus 3.46. One is? One is what? Minus four or uh, minus three point four six. Minus three point four six. And the two are Three point four six. So this is maxima and three point four six. Kitna? Three point four six. Three point four six. Ho gaya? Maxima minima ho gaya? Yeah. So now let me give you some work now. I think you've understood this whole concept, right? Yeah. So your up your same calm karna hai, take care. Your equations I'm gonna change now. These are all from past, past papers only. This is your, your homework. Take care. Y equals to e raised to power 6 e raised to power x minus e raised to power 3x. Next question is is my ko stationary point is missed one stationary point eh? station sp means stationary point x coordinate and nature okay next question is y is equal to e raised to power minus x sine x is maybe one stationary point x coordinate nature and is ka range up for the hour here zero to pi then the next question is Uh, can we start the next topic only right now? Okay. We hardly have any time. Okay. Sure. You have equations like clear? Yeah. These are your two equations. Now this is called the this is the last topic. Parametric equations. Okay. Now, parametric equations may as a situation of up keep us. There you will have two equations. Okay. Yeah. You will have two equations. Okay. One in x another in y okay or aap se bola jayega find 
डी वाई बाई डी एक्स समझ में आया मेरी बात एक्स की इक्वेशन अलग होगी वाई की इक्वेशन अलग होगी और फिर बोला जाएगा डी वाई बाई डी एक्स निकालने के लिए ठीक है समवर्ट सिमिलर क्वेश्चन यू हैव डन बिफोर बट अब ये साइन थीटा कॉस थीटा ई रेस्ट पर एक्स इनके टर्म्स में ठीक है सो द क्वेश्चन से इज फाइंड डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री माइनस टू कॉस टू थीटा एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू फाइव साइन थीटा नहीं फाइव साइन टू थीटा माइनस थ्री डू यू सी दट ना तो एक्स जो है उसमें जो वेरिएबल यहां पर है वो थीटा है और जो वाई है उसमें भी थीटा है और हमको डी वाई बाई डी एक्स निकालना है करेक्ट या ठीक है सो अब देखते हैं इसमें हमको करना क्या होगा वेरी इजी यू डन समथिंग लाइक दिस बिफोर वॉट यू आर गोइंग टू डू इज यू टू फाइंड फर्स्ट यू विल फाइंड डी एक्स बाई डी थीटा यू विल फाइंड डी वाई बाई डी थीटा और हमको क्या चाहिए हमको चाहिए डी वाई बाई डी एक्स करेक्ट तो हम क्या करेंगे इन दोनों को निकालेंगे डी वाई बाई डी एक्स लिखेंगे कैसे आएगा ये डी वाई बाई डी एक्स वेन यू हैव डी वाई बाई डी थीटा विच इज डिवाइडेड बाय डी एक्स बाई डी थीटा राइट तो ये तो फ्रैक्शन है ये क्या बन जाता है डी वाई बाई डी थीटा मल्टीप्लाइड बाय डी थीटा बाय डी एक्स तो बेसिकली आपको क्या so we just take a reciprocal of reciprocal of this. इसको आपको reciprocal करना like after we get the answer, right? Correct. D, D theta by dx निकालना है after you get dx by d theta. ठीक है Understood? And that's how you're going to form the equation. So finally, dy by dx will be equal to dy by d theta dx by d theta and all of that is just differentiation right is just differentiation yes clear hua isi ko the parametric equations jahan par hamare paas jo equations hai wo do equations ke form mein hai ek x mein hai ek y mein hai it the variables can change okay aur aapse bola jayega jo do equations hai ek x ke form mein hoga uska aur is y is wale ka dy by dx nikalo So when you in the x equation there is a minus two cos two theta, when we are differentiating that, like will it become positive sine theta? It will become ha minus minus plus हो जाएगा right? तो आप मुझे बस जरा quickly बता दो कि आपका d x by d theta कितना आ रहा है? Um so the two remains the same right? हाँ So it's two sine two theta, um into into I think nothing into two also because two theta है ना वो theta cos theta नहीं cos two theta है तो एक two इसकी वजह से और एक two इसकी वजह से भी होगा correct yeah so four sine two theta four sine two theta इसका आंसर आया अब d y by d theta का आंसर बताओ Uh, that is ten cos two theta. Ten cos two theta. So divide yeah, by that. Ab ab at you got the answer. The iska or iska. So now we are going to put it here. Divide by d theta is ten cos two theta upon four sine two theta upon four sine theta, and that is equal to. Four sine two theta. Ha, huh. that is equal to ten upon four can become five upon two. Cos upon sine becomes cot two theta. That's the final answer. Clear? Okay. Yeah. Okay. चलो एक क्वेश्चन और कर ले पैरामीटरिक फॉर्म का. Yeah. um uh, this you take as a homework ye wala x is equal to sin 2 theta minus theta 
and y is equal to cos 2 theta plus 2 sin theta. You have to show dy by dx is equal to 2 cos theta upon 1 plus 2 sin theta. Your homework. Okay. Can you go back to that homework once? Are there any more in that? There are two questions here and one from parametric equation. Take yeah. three questions here. Can you bring that? Are, these are long ones, okay? Uh, can you go on the tangents one? Huh? The tangents one, can you go on that? Go on that, Okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Taking a screenshot? Yeah. Give you a screenshot? Hmm. Take it. And now let me try to, you know, take a class tomorrow at, if uh, there's possibility, then I will take around 12.30 or I'll let you know. Okay? Okay. Yeah. And also the proving 